an attorney. I've lived in Ridgewood for 10 years now. And I have two children that have gone through the Ridgewood school system. One is graduating this year, and uh, the youngest will be going from BF to the high school next year. Um, I just, I know that, uh, I hate to be the first one to bring it up tonight, but I know that the Turk math curriculum has been the subject of some controversy within the district. And with little self-interest here, because my children are older at this point, I would like to offer some of my personal experience to be considered uh, on this issue. Um, in the fifth grade, my younger daughter, a previously good but not great math student, started to seriously flounder. Her teacher that year was an ardent advocate of Turk and was instrumental to its implement implementation at Travell. Under her instruction, unfortunately, my daughter lost ground with basic computational skills had great difficulty understanding both questions and answers posed, and could not grasp new concepts. Homework became a nightmare, sometimes taking hours, and always marked by anxiety and frustration. I, who am open-minded to new concepts and new ideas, was uh, open to the Turk approach, as explained to me, and assumed that the problem was with my child. I went so far as to hire this teacher to tutor my daughter, which was done within the Turk methodology. My daughter made little improvement in achieving mathematical competence. When she was in the seventh grade, I then employed a math tutor and things started to change, another math tutor. By learning fundamental skills in a logical sequence, meaningful math terminology, and formulas, and formulas deriving, sorry. It's okay. Uh, uh, consistent answers to straightforward problems, she gained both confidence and confidence. She went from barely passing math to being a solid B plus A student. Clearly my open-mindedness was misplaced. The problem seemed to be not my daughter's, but Turk's. I want to add also that this is a highly achieving verbal written language student who is supposed to be best served by the Turk method. So I've given it a lot of thought, what are the problems with Turk? Some, perhaps not all, certainly not all, are the lack of logical sequence or building blocks, a lack of clear direct standards or strategies, and thus no chance to feel confident in moving forward, no mathematically relevant terminology that is consistent with world guidelines. No textbook or workbook that assists parents with homework help, despite the large amount of homework assigned to be done at home. And finally, despite the rhetoric put forward by Turk advocates to the contrary, no balance of teaching, teaching methods is achieved in the classroom. I place no fault for this on the teachers. So much time is consumed by the other demands placed on them, by the convoluted method and group work of the Turk system that it simply does not happen. We end up with the worst of two worlds. Math-minded students who are not challenged and less math-oriented students who cannot achieve confidence. I certainly don't propose that an investigational method has no place in math instruction. However, of all subjects, math is one that must be learned sequentially. Our children need to learn basic skills and achieve oh, math please continue. and achieve standard math competency first, that is to crawl before they walk. Only then, in higher grades, can they delve successfully into the more esoteric math concepts. There's something wrong when so many parents in our district must hire private tutors to teach what is not taught in the classroom and where large numbers of students are pulled out to learn math. Implementing Turk in grades K through 8 is, I believe, a mistake, and is, uh, as evidenced by declining test scores within the pilot districts and by the experiences of other districts throughout the country. At a minimum, further investigation of alternatives to Turk and an evaluation of alternative approaches uh, under an objective rather than an experimental standard, should, I believe, proceed any further implementation of Turk in our schools. 
Thank you very much. Thank you for sharing your personal experience.